Well, now a United States Senator, Mark Wayne Mullins' district has become all of Oklahoma, and he says he saw quite a bit of it during the August recess. We were all over the state. I mean, it was, it was great. And Senator Mullins says everywhere he went, the main thing people wanted to talk about was the economy. If you're running a cow-cab operation, a farm, a retail, uh, convenience stores, uh, you know, or service companies, you're facing certain challenges that you didn't have uh, two years ago. Inflation has come down significantly, and unemployment in Oklahoma is at an all-time low. But Mullen says people still feel uncertain about the economy. There's no uncertainty about the standing of Oklahoma's military bases, which Mullen visited with Mississippi Senator Roger Wicker, the ranking member of the Senate Armed Services Committee. Everywhere we went, we actually also did a meeting with community leaders, too, and all of them just had an outpouring support for the base in their area. And he says it's so unique. Mullen says Oklahomans in general seem to appreciate what he and the rest of the delegation are doing. It's D.C. politics they don't get. It, it didn't make any difference where I was at. You always got the question, why can't you all get along? Mullen says he always tells people the Founding Fathers didn't intend for them all to get along, just to commit to the process. It is designed to work almost dysfunctional until you can find a consensus. And it seems a given some of that dysfunction will be on display in the coming weeks as Congress tries to figure out how to fund the government next year. The question is how long will it take to find a consensus? In our Washington Bureau, I'm Oklahoma's own Alex Cameron.